Today marks 100 years since a legendary discovery of King Tut's tomb. Our Kelly Kobiea has more on what's still being discovered in the desert sand a century later. He's the world's most famous pharaoh, an icon of Egypt, Tutankhamun, King Tut. This museum is incredible. The 3,000-year-old treasures from his tomb now on display in Cairo's Antiquities Museum, his gilded throne, the shrine of Anubis, god of the dead, and the most famous piece of all, King Tut's death mask. Look at the face. Look, look at the eyes. the eyes. Incredible. Nearly 5,000 items were found in King Tut's tomb, from the really big to the really tiny, and nearly all of them were in perfect condition. That's what made British archaeologist Howard Carter's discovery, November 4th, 1922, a worldwide sensation, the only royal ancient tomb found largely intact. When Tut's artifacts came to the U.S. in 1976, millions waited hours to catch a glimpse. Researchers have studied his treasures and his mummified remains. But there are more mysteries in the sand, just 20 miles south of Cairo, where a general and advisors to King Tut were buried. How old do you think they are? It's about uh, 3,000 years till now. And not far away, next to Egypt's oldest pyramid... We just found today another tomb, a big one. More ancient secrets waiting to be unearthed. Kelly Kobiea, NBC News, Cairo. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.